Hi, this is Dr. Dan Purser of danpursermd.com. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel where we try to combine natural medicine with modern medicine, unite them to make some sense of it all. Let's talk today about thyroid medications. I get all kinds of questions about patients that don't want to take synthetic thyroid medications. That's L-thyroxine or Synthroid they're talking about. You know what? It's fine. It's completely identical. Yes, it's chemically made all that, but it's still completely identical. Your body cannot tell the difference. So it's essentially bioidentical, uh, but it's not from natural substances. But I don't think that really matters if you're gonna take thyroid medication. To your thyroid you make in your body, the T4 you make in your body. So l or Synthroid is T4. Probably my favorite thyroid uh, to prescribe would be Nature Thyroid. It comes in grains, which are 65 milligrams. My patients go from, from one to two to even three grains a day. And if you have pituitary dysfunction, it's not gonna change your TSH. It's already at 0.1 or suppressed because you don't make it. I know a lot of doctors get confused by that and think I'm giving too much thyroid when in reality, you don't, aren't producing the TSH anyway. You can't produce TSH because you have a damaged pituitary like I do. And on the best day ever, you might make 0.1 <laughs> you know, nanograms of TSH in a day to simulate your thyroid, which is not enough. So I don't usually track TSHs in my pituitary dysfunction patients. There's no point in it. And doctors get confused by that. What I really like to follow is free T3 and free T4. I also will use Armour Thyroid, by the way, or generic Armour Thyroid, which works really well too. I also occasionally will use lyothyronine, and you can get compounded lyothyronine, that's T3 by the way, compounded uh, lyothyronine or compounded T4 at a pharmacy too. There's your options, I use them all, I use them all kind of interchangeably. Some patients prefer one form over another, it's according to the situation. If you're older and don't convert T4 to T3 properly, which can happen, if you have a 5 prime deodinase enzyme deficiency or a problem there, or 5 prime deodinase resistance, which can occur due to vitamin deficiencies or old age, or they just quit working correctly, then you'll need the combined T4, T3 that you find in Nature Thyroid or Armour Thyroid. I hope this helps a little. I like them all. There's a situation you need to use each one in. Regardless, this is Dr. Dan Purser. Thanks for watching. God bless and go in good health. For those of you who have medical questions or comments, don't leave them on YouTube. It's not allowed. You can't, I can't answer medical questions there because of HIPAA violations. So subscribe to my one of my emails and contact us through that through my website, danpressermd.com, and we'll try and answer it or we'll try and set up a phone call so I can answer it. Thank you very much.